Hello, everybody, and welcome this back. Won't be like any other battle I've been a part of. Yeah, you're right. Welcome back to Assassin's Creed Odyssey. So, in the last part, we weakened the Athenians' grip on Megalos greatly, and now we're going to war. Are you ready to crush the Athenians? Uh, yeah. Conquest battles. Once the nation power is low, a conquest battle becomes available. Both Athenians and Sparta reward epic gear for conquest battles. Defending a nation is easier, but provides less rewards. Attacking a nation is harder, but provides more rewards. Do you have an option on whether to go against Sparta or against the Athenians? Yeah, do battle. Ready for war. In the sick-ass outfit. <laughs> It'd be interesting if you can choose who to fight for. Because, I mean, you are sp from Spartan. You are from Sparta. So, it makes sense you want to fight for Spartans. I don't know, maybe they give you a reason to fight for Athenians. Send these Athenians to Hades! So, I got a feeling this is going to be, like, the first battle with, like, Leonidas. Oh, no, there's, like, an actual progress bar. I'm just going to swing wildly. Wherever I hit, I am sorry. Later, bitch. Ooh. So now no one should want to mess with me, right? Do you not see what I just did to your captain? I, th I swear, these guys... Like, these guys I'm fighting right now are harder than the captains. The captains are easy as shit. Oh, boy. I, didn't, I forgot what that does. Can I throw the spear? Okay, I only do it like when I'm... No, get your bow out. Or weapon. Maybe it's only with a sword? Let me see. Uh, it might be only when you're not in combat. Huh? Who's this guy? He's supposed to be the hard one. Okay. Can I hide for a second and get my health back? Nope, he came right at me. New mercenary discovered? Oh, I'm guessing this is him. Okay, let's switch back to the axe. Okay, this guy's actually pretty good on health. Wow, even that still hurt me. Alright, good thing I got that second, like, wind. Can you, like, get poisoned into your own gas? That would be tremendous. Well, shit. This guy? Yeah, he should put up a good fight. Oh, I have to start the battle again? God damn it. You know, the least you could have done is spawn me closer. You know, maybe you auto-saved as I talked to him. Be like any you other know what? I'm gonna auto save it or quick save it right now. Boom. Now, in case I die again, I don't have to walk all the way over here. To battle. All right, I'll just probably cut up to the part where I'm fighting that dickhead again right now. Okay. Ooh, look at me, Mr. Tough Guy. I can take all three guys at once. How about you fight me mano e mano? Oh, wrong guy. Should I see what he's weak to? I should probably take a look. Fire. I don't think I have anything that's fire. Come on, just die already. You're so close. Yes! See ya. Whoever the cunning. Alright, time to finish this battle. 
wonder if it's like actually keeping track of how many guys there are. Like if there's a certain amount and if that blue bar actually means it. Or if it's just like saying like, hey, we'll get there. Like if it empties out, are there going to be literally no guys left or like still a lot? Well, I think we did it. Am I like bloodlust now? Why is everything so much more colorful? Okay. Sparta has successfully defeated the Athians. Megaris will now side with Sparta. Alright, that guy died. I killed 22 soldiers and 5 captains. I'm happy with that. I would love to see like a battle mode where it's you versus all of them. Where's the wolf? The wolf requests the presence of the mercenary. It's about time. We oh, shall be up to he's gonna throw me off the cliff again, isn't he? With respect, he wishes to see the mercenary alone. What? I said the commander I wishes. I heard what you said. I just don't understand why. Well, don't question the messenger. Those were his orders, sir. Very well. Hoorah. It appears I have other matters to attend to. Okay, goodbye. I'm the new favorite. Okay, Mr. Wolf, it's about time. Helmet of Ares. Let's put that on. So you can actually somewhat see my face. Yeah, it looks pretty good. If I can keep leveling this up, I might just keep it. You can level them up, right? I think you can level each thing up to its... Like, what level you are? I don't know, I have to go to a blacksmith to see if that works. Level 10. This is it. What do I even say? You kick him. I got the ability. Just say the word, Cassandra. I bet he doesn't even recognize you. So you are the champion who won us today. Tell me your name, hero, so that I may greet you as a true warrior. Here, Pater. It's been a long time. Impossible. I saw you fall. You mean when you I threw me? Fall. You fucking threw me to my death. I did what was required of me as a Spartan. I've made my peace with that. You need to as well. You were my father. You were supposed to protect me. You were reckless. You forced my hand. I was protecting my brother because you wouldn't. The Oracle decreed that Alexios had to die. Her word is absolute. You know that. You can't cower behind your sense of duty anymore. Enough! I can't change the past. <laughs> I will live and die a Spartan. There's a large reward for the mercenary that can collect the wolf's head. Is that why you're here? Ooh. I'll get some answers. I'd, revenge could still be an option. After I get some answers. You've avoided the past long enough. Now you will answer to me! <laughs> Though you deserve death. There is no honor in vengeance. Or I won't kill him. You must face the ghosts of your past, Pater. And that is a fate worse than death. I have failed in my duty. I failed to protect you. To protect both of you. He's gonna kill himself. I loved you. And your brother. As if you were truly my own. 
But you are never mine. What? What do you mean? That is a question. You should ask your mother. Come wait. Of course, it's starting to rain. Find your mother. Find her. Whatever Marini is, she knows far more than I do. So if I killed him, how would I have gotten that info? Where will you go? To find my honor. Beware the snakes in the grass, Cassandra. Did I get I a new helmet? Out of here. I should head back to Varnavas. I did. The wolves. Oh, it's a quest item. Okay. Got a sword, though. Alright, complete episode two. Ugh. Also, what Cassandra said about facing your ghost, or facing the ghost, whatever. I fully believe that. It is worse to live a life, like, haunted by ghosts and what you've done than dying. Wait, I could probably just teleport. What am I doing? Why am I running? There we go. Okay, I'm back to the ship. Ship calling. Some of the city's harbors give you the opportunity to call your ship when you're on ground and in a ship calling zone. Okay. Uh, before I talk to you, I just want to see one thing. So, this is back under Spartan leadership. Can I... Like, turn the tide again? Because it says fortified. How much of this is Megaras? Just that much? So this is all Spartan land. Where are the Athenians? Okay. They're mostly the right side. What was the place I came from? Who rules that? I can't even... Oh, here it is. Nobody. It's its own territory. Okay. When was I here? Was I here? Why is it colored in? Uh, don't know. Okay. It'd be really interesting if you can keep going back and forth. But, don't know how that would really work. That looks like quite the storm! Yeah, sure. Alright, let's talk. So, did you kill your father? Step, father. I suppose the gods won't judge you too harshly for a step. Patricide. Nikolaos raised me, trained me. He was my father, even if he did try to kill me. Is that better or worse? No matter. Yours isn't the only complicated family in the world. Thank you. Thanks. I'm glad to have you around, Varnavas. He's a good I'm friend. I'm happy to be here. Would anything else help? Finding my mother. She's alive, Varnavas. <laughs> At least, Nikolaos thought so. Some good news, praise Ira. What's your plan? What course should I set, Captain? For now, we go to Fakis. Elpinor said he'd meet me there. He owes me money and an explanation. Aye, Cassandra. And let's seek the wisdom of the Pythia while we're there. If anyone has answers for you, it's the Oracle of Delphi. Okay. Uh, I'll consider it. I don't know what it is. Mm, I'll think about it. Good. You know, kings and queens travel to Fokis to consult the Pythia. She can start wars or end them. They say that... Yes, I know. That's enough Oracle talk for now. Hmm. Back to business. You know where to meet Elpinor, I suppose? His home is in Pilgrim's Landing, but... Nicolaus's last words to me were a warning of snakes in the grass. Sounds like you should make extra preparations. Elpinor is the one who should prepare. Snakes aren't that bad. Apollo's temple in Delphi when you're done dealing with the snakes. Why is there blood in the water? Oh, and Cassandra! In all the excitement, I nearly forgot. Terrible things have happened to your home. That old house? 
It was barely standing to begin with. I meant Kefalonia. A sickness has spread across the island. They say it started in Kausos. Thank God I got out of there. seem to be a cure. Many have died. Alaka. That priest was right. Just say the word. We can return to Kefalonia whenever you wish. Thanks, Varnabas. I'll keep that in mind. Let's go. Elpinor has a lot of explaining to do. Okay. Helix credits. 200 Helix credits have been credited to your account. You can spend them at any time by pressing the button in the menu to reach a store and acquire unique rewards. Okay, and I think the priest she was talking about is a side mission I did. If I have the footage, I'll put it right here. Murderers! Murderers! If the gods won't help you, the sickness must be destroyed by our hands. We have no choice. Help us! He won't let us go. What's going on? Kausos was consumed by plague. We couldn't keep up with the bodies. It was spreading. We had to intervene. They killed our brothers, our neighbors. We survived the massacre, but he'll kill us now. The gods have abandoned us. The sick must join the dead if we are to save the living. You burned the whole village? Many knights were lost brain. We had to take action. To scorch the blood fever out of Gaussos. Is there no hope for a cure? Nothing has worked. Sacrifice. Prayers. Healers won't come near us. Soldiers won't let us leave. The gods won't answer our prayers. But I don't know anything about the plague. There is nothing you can do. No! If you intervene, I will be forced to defend the gods' wills. Save us from him! Have pity! We aren't even that sick! We'll get better! Nobody gets better! This is the only way all of Kefalonia will save itself from extermination! Please! We have children! Think of them! Don't regret stopping here, Mistios. Let them go. What? You're no god. Hey. This is your last one. You're a hero. That priest came from the underworld. Some man of the gods. The real God sent you. Time to go. We're well enough to travel, but need healing. Before you go, take my drachmi. It can't pay for what you gave us, but it's all we have. Forget about that. Just travel safely. Your gift from the gods, Eagle Bearer. I hope they bless you. Bye, Kina. Be safe. And, yeah, it was like a little sickness island. Or like a little part of the island that was like... People were dying a lot. And so, uh, yeah. Why are there two different chapters? After what happened to Nicholas, Cassandra sought guidance from Barnabas, who encouraged her to consult the Oracle of at Delphini. Uh, as was the case with Elpinor, his reasons for wanting the Wolf Sparta dead were unknown. What was known was the was only that the price on the contract was high, and this contract was unlike any other. Okay. Um. You know what? Let's go do this one first. They're both main missions. I'll do them. I'm not bothering you, ship. Don't even think about it. God damn it. I wasn't even bothering him. Alright, you got them? Nah, screw it. Okay, I'm gonna stop off here because I just want to get that viewpoint just so I have a place to fast travel to in case I need it. And like, 
that thing is really far inland, so... I just might as well get off here and start making that travel. What a beautiful sink point from on top of this tiny little hut. Oh boy. Why'd you jump all the way down there? What's wrong with you? One thing I really like doing in Origins whenever I had to travel far. Just, uh, let the horse do all the traveling, stick to the roads, and just get a good view of the layout. How far up can I go before they stop moving? I think there's a certain amount. So where is he going? Yeah, you know, he's going all the way around. Honestly, I don't know if that'll be faster if I just climb it. Yeah, let's take a little detour. And like that, we're good on track. I think. Yep, we're there. Oh, yeah, I forgot, I wanted to see. Can I upgrade stuff to my level? Help you? Yes, I can. Wow. You can bring that bandit sword all the way up to 158 DPS. Wow. Okay. That's all I wanted to know. Thank you. Alright. Let's get that viewpoint. How was that? Is that like a... Was that thing on the left? Was that either for fighting or for plays? It looks like a stadium for both. Go check it out. What you got? A lot of seats and a semicircle of dirt. Uh, I'm not sure. I think it's for plays. But it can also be for fighting. You know, like a really... It's like the... Fuck, what am I saying? Why am I... Why is it black screen? What the hell happened? Okay. It's like the downgraded version of a Coliseum. How do I even... Oh, there we go. Hello. For a second I thought I was going inside the place. How'd you get here before me? Cassandra, isn't this remarkable? We're so close to the gods, I can feel Apollo all around me. How did it go with Elbinon? We can talk later in private. Who's this? Also, well, I didn't talk to him yet. He just saw the oracle. I couldn't help but ask if she's as glorious as they say. Well, is she? She left me with more questions than answers. That's yeah, the oracle do that. for you. You weren't lying. It really is the spear of Leonidas. Uh, I may have mentioned you. Oh, really? I would appreciate your showing a bit more secrecy. Well, it's just he seemed interested in legends. Like you. Uh, I thought you might get along. How did... Uh... That won't be too aggressive. You know my spear just by looking at it? You're more than some simple pilgrim. All things in Delphi are more than they appear. Even I. My name is Herodotus. I'm a story. That's probably somebody from history. I was. This war is forcing us all to new extremes. Hmm. That much is true. Why are you hiding your identity? I'm here on behalf of a man in Athens. A very powerful man. We intend to finally end this war. You told me you came to ask the Oracle a personal question. War is personal, Barnabas. So, you came to seek the Pythia's guidance on how to end the war? I Kill everyone. Simple as that. Something is wrong in Delphi. Guards at every turn, people being turned away. Uh, what did the Oracle tell you? You don't seem convinced the Pythia can be believed. What did she tell you? I asked her to show the path to the war's end. She said, Spring should not wish for winter, as it brings death with it. Such wisdom! I My don't God. understand the word of it, but that's why she's in there and we're out here. 
I know a threat when I hear one. <laughs> you were on Kefalonia for too long. Okay. This line is ridiculous. Are there always this many people to see the Pythia? These are more than just people. Every city sends a Theori or sacred ambassadors to seek guidance on behalf of their people. And people really are the desperate. Pythia not only shapes the destinies of individuals, but of the entire Greek world. Imagine what power one would have if they controlled what came out of her mouth. Apollo controls this. Of course he does. I don't think the guy on the right believes any of this shit. Delphi is nothing like they say. Has it always been like this? No. This was once an open and welcoming place. But war changes things. People seek out the Pythia for more political reasons. Prophecies in times of war often stir violent emotions. It's wise to keep your blades sheathed. Drawing blood in Delphi is considered an insult to Apollo. Punishment is severe. Nah, I don't care what Apollo thinks about me. I'll kill him. I have my own questions for the Pythia. But this time, I'll be an old woman by the time I see her. <laughs> You're joking! You carry more blades than a field of grass! I didn't come here to start trouble. Trouble? Just walk in! Who's going to stop you? The priest? <laughs> Cover the guards with more swords. All right. But if things get out of hand, I'm blaming you, Barnabas. Is she not every bit as great as I said? Okay. Well, I'm going to leave this part here. We'll speak with this uh, person. It's a person, right? I'm assuming they're talking about a person and not like a statue. Okay, I'm going to leave this part here. Thank you all for watching. Be sure to remember down below. Leave a like, subscribe, share, and I'll see you all in the next part. Goodbye.